Today we're looking at an AltoCraft 4.5 inch angle grinder. Now it does going to have a one piece auxiliary handle which is rather nice. And it's designed for 120 volts, so basically any household outlet. Now it does draw quite a bit of power, so I wouldn't recommend having a whole lot else on that breaker. Opening up inside we have our instruction manual, as well as the tools required to get this thing up and running. They've generously included several discs. There's that auxiliary handle I was talking about. Here is the actual main body. And our removable disc guard. Let's go ahead and get this assembled and uh, find something to grind up. Included is one sanding disc. We have two cutoff discs. And one grinding disc. This is one I'm going to be using. I'm going to take out some of my early test weld practices and see if we can't smooth this up a little bit. All right, and here's our unit. I don't have it plugged in at the moment. Here is on, and if you press this dimple while it is on, you will lock it in the on position. Tap here to unlock it. This is our wheel lock, which we're going to use to put on that cutoff disc, or the grinding disc. Now, I'm going to be using this left-handed. Grabbing this, you can add this to either, the, either side, depending upon your comfort. Let's get this plugged in and put to work, shall we? All right, we're back after it's been plugged in. Let's get this fired up. So in just those few seconds, it did take out those bubbles from the early welds very nicely. Let's see if we can't get a slightly smoother finish.